Hi, this is Carlos Cousins, and the following uh, Words in Context question is asking about the meaning of the word uh, reproof in the passage. Uh, now, first of all, if you know what this word means, this is a rather easy one because um, the definition here will match um, this word fairly, you know, directly. Um, to reprove is to... Uh, sort of blame somebody, uh, point finger at some point your finger at somebody. Uh, so to reprove here um, is, the, is the verb. And this is, you probably have heard of, a, of another word if you didn't know this one, uh, a reprobate or to reprobate. Um, these are uh, related to each other. So same thing here, you're going to accuse somebody of something or, you know, the more common definition for reprobate is somebody who doesn't, you know, uh, fit into, I guess, overly religious standards here, somebody who's sort of like a lost soul or whatever. Um, so th these, these are similar in that people would like point your finger and, you know, uh, reprimand as answer choice A says. So that's why this is the correct answer. It's not an apology, praise, or sarcasm. But let's go ahead and think about this in the context. If you didn't know, how could you have figured this out? And that's what's nice about um, the ACT uh, passages here. There's always a context. Let's go over to the yell club. He continued moodily and then added with an implied reproof. You've given up your job. You've got nothing else to do. Well, the friend just told him he got fired. And this friend says, you've given up your job. So he's being accusative. He's not being very nice. It looks like he's being reprimanding. This wouldn't be an apology. You're telling a friend, and because of the, the colon here, we know the reproof is him saying you've given up your job. You've got nothing else to do. The friend isn't apologizing for him losing his job. He didn't fire him, so that doesn't make any sense. The friend isn't praising him. He says, you've given up your job. It's your fault. That's not praise. And wish it was sarcasm, but it's really not. I think this is a reproof here. And from the, from the tone that he has the entire passage, he actually believes his friend is in the wrong, that there's some character flaw of him that makes, uh, makes him lose money or be it in what he calls, you know, uh, difficulties, right? Mild difficulty pretty often. So this isn't sarcastic. He actually means it, um, which is very negative, not very nice, right? So that's definitely reprimanding. Uh, so that's why A is the best answer to it. So I'll help with this problem and happy prepping.